A top district official told the school board this week that they cannot continue to ignore the state of the former William Penn High School, saying that it's become a safety hazard. Well, if something happens on that building, I mean, that's district property. Superintendent Eric Turman says the former William Penn High School has become a site for break-ins and vandalism. People have even been seen on the roof of the 250,000 square foot building. In its current state, it's impossible to secure. Terman presented several options to the school board this week, such as demolishing the building at a cost of several million dollars, opening the space up for future buildings, use as fields, or sale. The building could also be renovated, but with costs that could rise above $80 million. The building and land could also be sold outright. Terman wants people to know the district intends to keep the spirit of the old high school alive, but something still needs to be done about the building. The William Penn that they either graduated from or went to, unfortunately, uh, because of mismanagement of that building, it's a shell of what it was. Terman told the school board that it costs about $89,000 a year to insure this building. It also costs the district about $50,000 to have a security monitor keep troublemakers away. In Harrisburg, Tom Lehman, WGAL News 8.